about everybody here tonight. You totally don't believe me? Okay. Did anybody see that girl up in Tokyo last night? The one wearing the mini skirt and drinking Smirnoff ice? Really trashy one up in Tokyo. I mean, she just knows she's just wrong for that one, eh? Well, do you know who that was? Jeremy Heckman. Jeremy Heckman's a woman, and he likes Tokyo. Nobody likes Tokyo, but Jeremy Heckman likes Tokyo. Yeah. And he also, she, he, he, she told me something that Patrick Goddard told her. Apparently, after 10 years of competing in ultimate rhythmic gymnastics, Patrick is sabotaging competitions because he doesn't want blood on his hands. Apparently, ultimate rhythmic gymnastics is like a, a really dangerous sport. Like, one in 10 fringe producers die in ultimate rhythmic gymnastics. I don't know. I didn't believe it either. I thought it was total bullshit. But I mean, then I saw his ribbon collection. It was obviously kind of uncomfortable. Yeah, and then Patrick Goddard told me that Valerie Arshan got Amy Blackmore pregnant. Yeah, pregnant. Yeah, and Amy Blackmore also has a cult where after 11 p.m. she turns into a linebacker named Ted and tackles random people at the Copa. Very strange. Valerie told me that, but she's one to talk because she does the exact same thing, and she also drinks cheap liquor and has a collection of chewed gum and has a shrine to the Jonas Brothers. And she also told me that Tristan Brand is a phone sex operator, and that Natalie Gellin is a werewolf, and that Jean Mongeau and, and Jeremy Richardson are, are the ones who sold the forum to Pepsi, and that's why I had to do a fringe show about hockey in the frickin' Bay St. Michelle bathroom. And just because I spend every night at 7 in a bathroom does not make me a pack bunny. That is just the name of my show.